Hi there, I'm Abby Schuft from the University of Minnesota Extension and today I'm at the Minnesota State Fairgrounds to give you some tips and tricks on keeping your horses healthy with biosecurity when you're away from home. Follow along as we introduce you to some really basic and simple biosecurity practices that you can use every day when you're away from home. As the saying goes, an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. Before you leave your farm, work with your veterinarian to keep your horse up to date on vaccinations and deworming. Be aware of all health requirements of the event and the state you are traveling to. Keep sick horses at home. They can potentially spread disease or become more ill under the stress of travel. When possible, use your own trailer to haul your horse. If you are not hauling your horse, or you are hauling for somebody else, be certain to have a conversation well ahead of your departure about expectations and current horse health of all the horses that will be on the trailer. If you are staying at another facility overnight, be sure to clean the new living space your horse will have. This includes removing any residual bedding or other organic material from the stall floor, walls, or the camping or tie-out facilities. You may choose to use a disinfectant on the surfaces as well. Carefully read the instructions for any disinfectant product you choose to ensure proper application rate and contact time. Do not wipe off the product unless the instructions say to do so. Allow the disinfectant to dry completely before bedding or moving your horse into the space. Animal disease can be easily spread on tack and equipment, especially when so many unfamiliar horses gather in one location. When you are at a horse show or other event, avoid sharing tack and equipment between horses. This includes grooming tools, buckets, and riding gear. When possible, designate duplicate sets of hard goods like buckets and brushes that are only used away from home and stored in the trailer. It will be common to have many people using the same water pump or spigot to water and bathe horses away from home. If there is a hose connected, hold the hose out of the bucket to avoid submerging the end into the bucket. We don't want to double dip our hoses. Limit nose-to-nose -nose contact with horses that are unfamiliar to you and your own horse. This can be accomplished by hanging barriers, such as a tarp, between stalls, or keeping an empty stall or tax stall between your stall neighbors and keeping a safe distance from other horses in the warm-up and holding pens. Please do not be tempted to graze your horse in public areas when away from home. Walk right on by and reward your horse with an alternative treat. In summary, to practice good biosecurity to keep your horses healthy away from home, avoid sharing tack and equipment. This includes hay nets, buckets, brushes, and your tack and equipment. If you're going to share a trailer ride to the show or event, make sure you have clear expectations among all the parties involved with your horse's travel. Otherwise, use your own trailer to go to the event. Clean the horse area up removing all organic matter and disinfect if you would like that you're, where your horse will be spending time. Don't double dip the hose, especially with a shared hose. Avoid grazing in public spaces. Instead, use alternative treats to reward your horse. And finally, limit nose-to-nose -nose contact with horses that are unfamiliar to you or to your horse. Thanks for watching.